Hey everyone, okay, today is Wednesday and um, it's getting actually a little hard to keep up with these outfits of the days now so they might have to stop for a little while but maybe I'll bring them in for a week every month or something. How about that guys? Let me know what you think. Um, I have just the hair that I had yesterday, I didn't wash it today and I haven't brushed it and I haven't done anything so this is just what it looks like because if I tamper with this right now it's not gonna go how I want it and the only way I can is either if I straighten it or if I actually take the time to pull out individual strands and curl it but then um, it will be a mix of perfect curls and frizz so that means I would have to curl my whole hair and I just cannot be bothered to do anything like that so I just leave it like this the messy bedhead look kind of beachy messy waves right um, on my face today for a foundation I decided to open up my Stila Ket yeah, I know, I wasn't supposed to open it up, but I did. I really wanted to try it, and I used their, um, that little sample tube of their new sort of foundation, which is also a concealer, a primer. It's like an all-in-one thing, and I used that to cover my face today, and it's done pretty good coverage. So I didn't put any concealer on my face either. It didn't completely mask them, but it was enough to be natural, and it didn't show very much after I put like blusher and bronzer so it's hidden quite well so I really like that but if you have maybe darker scars or blemishes you still might need a concealer but overall I think this is a very nice light coverage um, foundation type thing so far I don't know I've just put it on um, dual bronzer NARS Desire which is a pink but I really buffed it out just to give a flushed look um, on my eyes today, I just have Brulee as the highlight. I have Kitten, Stila Kitten on my eyelid. And then I smoked it and darkened it up with Cork and Shadowy Lady in the crease and corner. And then um, Shadowy Lady all at the bottom. A little bit of Kitten in the inner tear duct area. Stila Topaz eyeliner and just Bad Girl Mascara. On my lips, again, I just have um, the Peach color from the Revlon um, new lipstick range and I really love that color it's my favorite color out of all of them and as an eyeliner I didn't really put like an eyeliner on top of my lips I just smoked out shadowy lady as you can see just to smoke it and darken it up it just makes my um, eyelashes look a little bit darker and I need that otherwise I look kind of um, dead looking if I don't have some sort of deepness right at the roots then on my nails, I just have Espresso Your Style by OPI, which is probably one of my favorite summer colors. And I have a review and loads of swatches on my blog. It's um, one of like the most recent ones, I think. So just look down there. It has like a really good um, swatch on what the color really is like. So I really like that. Then on my wrist, I just have my Michael Kors watch, which is like a tortoise shell. Then I have my prayer band and then I have my fiance's um, cuff. So I have this long necklace too which you can actually shorten quite well by BCBG Max Azria and as you all probably have guessed I really really love that store. I love everything in it and it's completely my style and I wish I owned the store. So um, I have a necklace from there and it's basically like a flat um, bent metal gold coin like round thing I guess and on it has my star constellation and so it's just like three uh, it's like kind of like a triangle but not joined together and each one has like a little starburst and a little diamond rhinestone in between it's kind of hard because it's like a sort of a bent metal so it's all gonna just reflect but I hope you can see that and at the back it says Aries because that's my star sign so I thought that was really really cool it kind of just um, matches the style that bohemian look that I'm kind of going for today unintentionally <laughs> and then I have this dress which is really cute it has a lot of like lace going on it's very country style I believe and um, it's by Airy and I paired it up with this belt which is a deep brown and it has like this gold going on and I think this is from BB last year but it's a really pretty dress it has like I don't know if you can see those little eyelets as such um, it's really really cute and I just put this belt in to cinch my waist in and yeah, it's, it's very nice. So this is what it looks like overall. 
really cute. And then if I get cold, I have this navy blue cardigan, which is not my Zara cardigan. This is a shorter one, and this is from J. Crew. And I just think um, you can pair it up with a long one easily or a short one. It doesn't really matter. Because I was going for like more of a, a younger look, I decided to um, go with a shorter cardigan, and the sleeves are quite short too. So as shoes, I have my Tory Burch, and they also have like a tortoiseshell resin sort of look. So I feel that goes really nicely with my watch, and it has a gold plaque since I'm wearing a lot of gold jewelry today. So um, yeah, that's that. Then of course I have my Never Fall again. You guys always want to see my bags in it, even though it's the same one every day, but. That's what I look like. So I'm going to go to the back so you can see the whole outfit. So yeah, again, very effortless. Um, oh, do you like my roses at the background? They're so beautiful. My fiance bought them for me yesterday. And I really like them because they're not like red, red roses. They're kind of like got the orange in it. And um, actually, they look more orange on camera always, but it's more of a tomato red. It's really, really pretty. And they were from Costco, too, because they have the most amazing flower selection ever. Really, really pretty. So, yeah, that is my outfit of the day. All right, guys, I hope you have a lovely Wednesday, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.